Hi, Martin here, and today I'm going to be talking about how to take a screenshot on Windows. So let's get started. So in order to take screenshots on Windows, we're going to be using a piece of software called the Snipping Tool. Now I have it pinned to my taskbar down here. So this is the icon that you're going to be looking for. But you can simply head over to the search, type in snip, and then you'll find the snipping tool here. So once opened up, you'll be greeted with a screen that looks like this. Um, before I go too much into uh, the layout of this interface, you will also see right in the middle, it says press Windows logo key plus shift plus S to start a snip. So you don't actually have to go down to the taskbar or the search bar for the snipping tool. You can just use the shortcut uh, Windows logo key shift and S and that will start a snip. So why don't we go ahead and do that? So Windows shift S and you'll see we now have some new options here at the top of the screen. So when we want to take a screenshot, we have four different options. So option one is rectangular mode. So that's where we'll click and drag a rectangle over a section of the screen, and that will create a snip for us. We then have the free form, which essentially allows you to draw any shape you like and take a screenshot. The third option is window mode. So you can select the window that you want to take a screenshot of, and it will take a screenshot of the entire window. And then lastly, we have full screen mode, which will capture the entire screen. So let's go ahead and keep it on rectangular mode. And I'm just going to take a screenshot of the center of my screen here. You'll see I get a pop up in the bottom right hand corner. So it says select here to mark up and share the image. So I'm going to click on that and it will add it to my snipping tool window here in the middle of the screen. So I now have my screenshot here and I have a few editing options at the bottom. So things like a ballpoint pen, highlighter, eraser, ruler. I can also crop my image. So let's go ahead and choose one of these options. So let's go ahead and hit crop. And I'm just going to crop a little bit closer to the actual window in my screenshot. So these kind of quick um, editing tools are just quite useful when you're just looking at getting a quick, quick screenshot of a section of your screen. So once you're happy with your screenshot, you've got two options over here. One is copy. So I could hit copy and then I can go ahead and paste that into the document I'm working on. If it's something I want to save, I can hit save and then make sure I save that on my laptop ready to use in whatever documents I would like. So why don't we go ahead and let's try a uh, new and let's just select one of the other options. So let's go to freeform. And then from here, I can just draw around my window, let go. And then I'll click on my snipping tool down here. So you'll know that there's a new snip because it will start glowing red. And I can see that I've got my screenshot here. And with this screenshot, I can do all the other things that I was doing before. So I can uh, mark it up, I can crop it, and then I can save and copy. So there you have it. That's how you can take screenshots or using the snipping tool on Windows. So just remember, if you want to take a quick screenshot, just hit that Windows key, Shift and S, or bring up that top menu bar. You can take your screenshot, edit it, and then use it in the documents that you need. So I hope this video has been useful. If it has, please give it a like subscribe to the channel and comment below. Thanks, and I'll see you in the next video.